the year ago. It seems like just yesterday where I was up here, I was giving a speech about taking over the role as being the chamber president. Now, one year later, we continue to make progress in making the Greater East Hampton Chamber of Commerce a group that you would be proud to be part of. We have followed through on our continued promise to get the word out about your businesses. The Chamber website redesign was one of the first things that we did in 2012. A few of the new features we've added included the, the ability to add social media links and directions to your business. One of our more proper, popular offerings for 2012 was the Video Member Spotlight. Now just over a year old, and with over 2,000 views combined, the Marketing Committee continues to work with Sven Kleinhorn, Kier Horn, uh, from E-Town Videos, Frank Fahey of Frank's Fine Editing, to produce these great advertising pieces at no charge to our members. We already have a 2013 book of members looking to take advantage of this benefit. It's a great thing, I don't know if, I'm hoping uh, you've all seen some of these videos, but they're, they're really great pieces and we've got a lot of great feedback from people. So take, take a minute, if you haven't been to our website, you can find it there or on our Facebook page as well. The Chamber has been working with many departments within the city as well. In early 2012, we helped organize the East Hampton Department Head Forum. Working with the East Hampton City Planner, the forum was a great way to hear from all the departments in relation, into, in relation to how they interacted with the business community. We will continue to provide input to our city leaders on issues that directly impact your businesses. In 2012, as Bill mentioned a little bit, we started what's called the Manhand Bridge Construction Newsletter. And we also started the text alert system. The Chamber has established a relationship with Mass DOT that will help provide us uh, information as this project moves forward. These two pieces will help not only the businesses affected, but it will also allow the community to be able to keep up to date as the main RA of East Hampton is impacted. By the way, if you haven't already, you can sign up for the text alert system by simply taking out your phone and texting the word manhand to 96362. In 2013, we're looking again to do more for our members. We're working on establishing several member-to-member -member benefits as well as starting a business development group. This group will work to connect small businesses and large businesses in navigating the day-to-day -day business world. Not your typical networking group, but something more along the lines of a group that will help with things like marketing, insurance, social media skills, business plans, and so much more. We continue to work to find ways to make a better chamber for you. I've said this more than a couple of times over the, over the last year or so. You have a choice in what you do with your advertising dollars. It doesn't matter if you're in business with 100 employees or a sole proprietor. You want to know that you are spending your money wisely. I know the board of directors, as many have before it, will continue to work hard to make sure, without a doubt, that you have chosen the right place to use your money. Thank you again, and as always, I am honored, as anyone should be, for the opportunity to lead your Greater East Hampton Chamber of Commerce. And I wish you all a very successful 2013.